In this video, a transmitter on VHF 99 MHz, where the tank circuit plays a secondary role. Normally, when you make an oscillator, the tank circuit, and that's this, plays the more, most important role uh, regarding the frequency that's generated. But this oscillator here also makes a sine wave on 99 MHz without a coil. That's very uh, peculiar. I've also um, showed, that, showed that in an earlier video. But uh, my thought was to connect a tank circuit on say 99 MHz to this circuit. So with, without this tank circuit it oscillates and with this tank circuit it oscillates and the good thing from it is that you can tune in here with the 30 picofarad capacitor that's here, this one, also to the 99 MHz band. So it's a kind of loose coupling and in my opinion it could be that this oscillator works more stable compared to circuits where only uh, the tank circuit is the frequency dependent circuit. I put down the camera and put on the radio now on 99 MHz. This is uh, the German radio station via the cable on 99 MHz. I switch on the power supply now. And we can see that our oscillator dominates over the 99 MHz frequency. My counter reads 99.4. And that's also the frequency from this radio stations on radio station on the cable. So this oscillator here, and that's this circuit, overrules the 99 MHz on my radio. And here you see the waveform, not very clear to see, and I can't make it better because my scope only goes to 60 MHz. But uh, I can show that when I tune the coil here, there is an effect. So I can tune in here on that frequency, 99 MHz, but also detune. So that means, in my opinion, that this is a quite useful oscillator because it also oscillates, sorry, it always oscillates, and you can connect a certain coil to it um, that uh, oscillates on a certain frequency. So uh, you can use, in my opinion, this oscillator for many frequencies in the VHF band. And use a tank circuit here to tune it uh, in a precise way. So here a kind of course generating from the frequency, here a more precise, this acts in a certain way as a kind of filter, etc. etc. When you mount here an antenna via a capacitor. Uh, the transmitter will transmit over a, a more wide distance, etc. etc. But um, the most important thing that I wanted to show in this video that uh, you can make an RC transmitter on VHF and tune it precisely by tank circuit.